With million dollar cars as the backdrop, Alaska state troopers making the pitch that their state is open for business. If they want to see a difference, come to Alaska. Um, the environment is a lot more law enforcement friendly. Um, we'll treat you right. We want you to come. The department isn't tiptoeing around the issue. You know, they're concerned about the, the COVID vaccine mandates. They're concerned about being told not to do their jobs. They know many departments in Western Washington are in flux, losing officers, and they're pitching Alaska hard. The Alaska State Troopers are hiring, offering as much as $20,000 in signing bonuses for transferring officers, plus other incentives. The Alaska State Troopers do not have a current vaccine mandate, and we don't expect to have one. Washington State lost more than 100 troopers when the vaccine mandate took hold in October. Remember this video? And Jay Ansley can kiss my Seattle feeling the pressure too. The department is currently facing emergency staffing levels. I've always said that we need 1,400 officers uh, currently in the department. Uh, we are right now deployable around 1,015. Uh, we have a number of officers that are out on leave and we need to grow the department. The Alaska State Troopers with a similar goal. State Positions they hope to fill with Washington State, State officers Alaska. willing to make the move north to the last frontier. And hopefully they take a look at us and decide this is actually something that's possible. This is something that would benefit me and my family and is going to benefit law enforcement um, somewhere at least. And hopefully that somewhere is Alaska. In Tacoma, Sebastian Robertson, King 5 News.